Hey, how's it going? Another beautiful day out here. Yesterday I was talking about making decisions about investing in different uh, tools, software, anything that has to do with your business. And today's topic is somewhat along the same lines, but it just dovetails into it nicely. It's what brought to mind after I was talking about buying the stuff that you need for your business. And I remember a eight-figure earner I once knew said that entrepreneurs lead with their wallet. And I know what he meant because you simply have to be willing to invest in your business if you ever intend to get anywhere. You are not going to be able to operate a business with no capital output. It's just not going to happen. Anyway, I was thinking about whether to call this momentum. Now, I don't know if it's momentum or not. A lot of people don't 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 subscribe to the theory of momentum. But I can tell you this: I've had this this theory in my life for as long as I can remember, and that is that you get these opportunities that show up. In the opportunity in the universe or God or whatever it doesn't matter what you believe this this will still work we'll set these opportunities in front of you from time to time and you can take them or leave them it doesn't really matter except for one thing that I believe I have put my finger on which is if you consistently ignore or don't take advantage of opportunities as they're presented, and these include the ones that you don't recognize until later, but if you don't take advantage of them, they stop coming as frequently. In other words, the less you, t you take up and do something with, the fewer you will see. And the, the converse is also true. The more opportunity you grasp that you take, the more opportunities will be presented and more frequently. And the reason I'm thinking about this is because I've seen it so many times where people whine about not having enough opportunity or not enough going on. Which side note, by the way, if you're in America today like I am and you're saying there's no opportunity, you've, you've got to seriously pull your head out of your fourth point of contact and take a look around there has never in the history of the world been the kind of opportunity that we're seeing right now it's everywhere it's everywhere you look and starting right now if you might already be behind the power curve starting right now you or your kids or whoever you know must begin to find a way to use the tools available to you with the internet, your smartphones, everything to create income for yourself and by yourself. This is the future. Let's get with it. <laughs> so anyway, these are the opportunities that surround you daily and you must begin to take advantage of them if you expect them to continue to show up. And the funny thing about it is, this goes right along with my theory my my observation that the anything you do you just start doing it and as you continue things show up you gather them to you, you make good decisions or bad and opportunities along the same path is what I'm specifically talking about today each one that you grasp and move with that moves you further towards your ultimate objective, which whatever your business objective is, anything you do in that, in that direction will add to and increase your ability to make more things happen, which in turn causes more opportunities to show up that you take advantage of, that you learn from, and you grow with. And then as you go along, you become what it is you always wanted to, to be. So take a look around. Look at the opportunities in front of you. Develop your intuition so that you can hear it speaking to you. And once you see something that will 
move you further along the path to your objective, you grab that dude and run as fast as you can. <laughs> Straight do, do whatever it takes to make it happen. Because that right there is a key to success. That's what I got for you today. I'll talk to you tomorrow. I'm out.